Welcome to Venom number 12. I just found a cat toy in my bed. This is not the first time. So today I'm on my bed. Not really sure why. I really want to go to sleep, but it is not time. But let's talk about stress dreams and sleep. I have been having a lot of stress dreams lately, about twice a week, which is not normal for me. As I was saying though, most of my stress dreams are about politics nowadays and nuclear bombs, which is not a fun thing. What happens when I have a stress dream is I stay asleep, I just cannot wake up, or I could probably wake up if I really needed to, but I don't wake up usually. I just spend the entire night really tense and really scared or sad. And then when I wake up, it takes me a minute to realize that it wasn't real. I am lucky enough to be a person who does not experience sleep paralysis. I know some people who do, and it is really scary um, just imagining that because like, if I think about it, I'm paralyzed all night in my stress dream. But if I were to wake up and think that that were a reality and not be able to move, that would... who I would never go to sleep again. I don't really know why I've been having more stress dreams lately. School is over, so I'm not stressing about that, but I also don't have school to distract me from everything that's going on in the world. All the thoughts that I said, oh, I'll think about this when I have time to think about it and I'll push it to the side for now. All that is like, whew, coming up. A couple nights ago, I had a stress dream that I was in a building and that the US had um, created a type of nuclear bomb that targets only one square block. And I was in that square block and I was just watching slowly the building around me like, deteriorate and everything just falling in slow motion and everything just getting leveled in slow motion. It was super scary, like I was trying to run away from it but I couldn't and it was just like a couple nights ago I had a different stress dream that a family member of mine had not died in the way that I was told and that my entire life was a lie. See, the thing is, I don't know where these are coming from. I'd like, I actually am going to ask this this time. I usually don't ask viewer, whoever you are, to respond. But if you have any, like, stories to tell about stress dreams or ways to stop them so that I can sleep better and be less tired, that would be great. Other than that, I'm going to say goodbye and I will see you tomorrow.